reveal gold sovereign. Then cast them in the fountain and make a wish. It's an Orlesian high society game. From the looks of this crowd, I guess nobody is in a wishing sort of. Is something the matter? I've come a long way to visit the legendary Chateau Hain. I'd be devastated to leave without seeing inside. I've heard the music room is the envy of Orlais. Uh, and the uh, ballroom is the single greatest example of flooring. In Fadus. I'll die if I don't view those treasures with my own eyes. Ah, <sighs> well, we can't have guests expiring. I'll see about getting you a tour. Let me handle him. As soon as I have the key, we can signal the others. <laughs> my, what a big sword you have. Do they give those to all the chevaliers? So impressive. Lovely party. Well? He doesn't have it. What? He forgot he'd given the key to one of the servants. What kind of guard forgets that he's locked himself out of the castle? Don't worry, Talis. We'll find this servant. Right. Nothing to worry about. This can still work. So, let's find the servant. How many could there be? Well, he no is one. a lesion. I'm trying to stay positive, you know. Welcome. Are you enjoying the Duke's party? This is supposed to be the social event of the whole year, you know. I... Talis? Leliana, it's so lovely to see you again. You look stunning this evening. Your hair is darling. Did you do it yourself? I get the distinct impression you've met before. Oh, briefly. A long time ago. You meet all sorts of people in Orle. It keeps life exciting. Well, I'm glad you two had this chance to chat. Yes, it was very fortuitous. We shouldn't take up more of your time, Liliana. I'm sure you have things that need attention right now. are Leandra Amel's oldest boy, yes? I heard you were living with your uncle. How is your dear mother? I didn't think she had any friends who still lived in Kirkwall. No? That is a terrible shame. I have not seen dear Leandra in many years. I miss her so. I don't think we've been introduced. I am Comtesse Dulcie de Lancé. My husband and I were acquaintances of the Amels, but that was many years ago. You sound like you've met my uncle. Oh, yes. Little Gamelin Amel. I have not seen him in years, of course. I'm sure she'll be glad you asked after her health. I'm sure she will. I can't do that. Sir Rahawk, I didn't think you were going to attend. Honestly, I didn't plan on it either, but here I am. I'm glad you came. Otherwise, I'd be talking to the Delonces. All the soap in Thedos couldn't make me clean after that. What do you think of the party so far? Recommendations for people I should chat up? The gentleman over there is Bantigan of Ferelden, younger brother of the Earl of Redcliffe. And of course, there's Lord Cyril, Duke Prosper's son. Who are the worst in the crowd? Do you see the two young ladies over there? That's Babette and Fifi de Lancé, daughters of the Comte de Lancé. Don't make eye contact. You'll thank me later. 
I've never seen anything like it. So polite. That's certainly one way to put it. We should probably go mingle a bit more. Of course. We'll speak later, Lady Elegant. The hunt was spectacular, was it not? Cahir must like you, my dear Hawk. He's not usually so polite. The hunt was exciting, wasn't it? I didn't have the pleasure of seeing much, but I heard it was quite the event. You sound Ferelden. It's good to see another countryman here. There's Perrin, but he's... peculiar. A pleasure to meet you. If you speak to Ban Perrin, I don't advise you to bring up the Chantry, or Knickers. Sarah Hawk. It's good to see you again. Seneschal, dear, introduce me to your delicious friend. Serendipity, this is Sarah Hawk. Awkward. So, can we talk about something else now? It's been delightful meeting both of you. Don't be a stranger. An excellent part. Another caprice. How many of these are there, I wonder? Put what you found to good use. I just... ...discovered more social interests. <laughs> Can I interest you in some Antivan olives? Or I have some smoked am from the Andrefels. They say it tastes of despair. Wait, does it really? How can ham taste like despair? Why would anyone eat it if it did? That's what the importer said. They all talk like that. This wine has notes of oak and springtime. This cheese tastes of sorrow. Thank you, miss. None for me at the moment. Nobody has wanted anything. Olive duty is the worst job. I must have offended the cook. I don't suppose we could have a peek at the kitchens. I'd love to see this hopeless dish in all its glory. I don't know. I, I shouldn't leave my post. I promise we won't tell a soul. Just a quick look. I suppose I could get you a very quick look. The upstairs maids will be so jealous when they find out. Very well. Follow me. I know, right? They treat you like part of the furniture. I'm surprised they don't sit on it. Avoid the cheese plate. Terrible. Have you got the key? I'm usually better at this. She didn't have the key either. Uh, this isn't supposed to be so complicated. Don't beat yourself up about this, Talis. We'll find a way in. I hope so. The servant says she gave it to the Duke's son, Lord Cyril. Let's find him and hope he didn't pass it on to his father. So, Lord Cyril. Welcome. I don't think we were introduced. You are Lord Amel, yes? It's Hawk, actually. Of course. I beg your pardon, Lord Hawk. You sound Ferelden. I thought you were a marcher. Please, take this caprice as a token of my sincere apology. It's our legion custom. Cast it into the fountain here, and uh, you might get a wish. Where are your knickers this time, Perrin? <laughs> Shut up, you painted shrew! 
What entertaining manners our guests have. <laughs> Don't you agree, Hawk? Talis here has a message for you, Lord Cyril. It seems to be urgent. This should only take a moment, my friends. Enjoy the party in my absence. But, yes, the, the Regency wallpaper is quite lovely. I agree. It, and I... <laughs> oh, I wouldn't sit... Uh, oh, forget it. That wyvern blood has some kick, doesn't it? This is officially my worst night ever. Not Lord Cyril's type. Maybe he just doesn't like elves, or women. In either case, you're the answer. He has the key, go get it. What? It's your turn, Hawk. Go on. I guess it wouldn't hurt for me to go talk to him. Please, please try. I think he likes you. So good luck with that. Thanks. I think so, yes. Let's just get going. Tell the elf that her pleas are for nothing. She's pretty enough, I suppose. No doubt there are some men who would like that sort of thing. I thought you might be a man of refined tastes. I heard the same of you, Monsieur Hawk. <clears throat> Why don't we talk again after the party? You have it! Tell me you have it! I have it. Good, then we can find the... jewel and get this over with. And here I thought we were getting along so well... I can't imagine anyone I would rather attend an Orlesian party with, even if you are human. Let's find that door and get inside. No need for you to die today, friend. Just move on. You never saw us. You could have walked away. Of course, he didn't walk away. That'd be a bad trait in a guard. I know that. It's not like his family can say, we thought he only had to bake cookies. There are other paths. They do not all need to lead to the same destination. Enough. We're here for the heart. I'd like to do this quietly, alert as few guards as possible. What do you think? Let's do it quietly. We shouldn't get into fights if we don't have to. I'm glad you agree. Let's go. This part of the chateau will be crawling with guards. We'll have to try our best to keep out of sight. Or we could try to create distractions, provided you're good at throwing stones. And if all else fails, we'll give them a sharp knock on the head. Right, of course. Just try not to do it all the time. All right, I'm ready when you are. Quickly, over here.
someone's head. Hard in Hightown too. Even harder. Zarek will want to know about this. Must be hearing things. Did you hear about the Duke's meeting with the Empress? I never listen to court gossip. That'll get you killed, my friend. Now, I have too much to do preparing the banquet and Leopold's dinner. You don't want to see her with them, you're hungry. If you need something, ask one of the servants. Well, why are you still bothering me? There's a problem in the courtyard. Something about a poisoned comtesse. The servants were looking for you. A maker's breath. What have those useless elves done now? I suppose I'd better deal with this.
think Leopold's going to be an unhappy whipper now for that. A miniature painting. Bethany would love this. like he'd never punched before. Make it breath. See anything? Bugger Prosper's vault if someone got out. Here, let's move. What was that scrabbling noise? <sighs> what does Babette want now? Her tea was too cold. Oh, of course. It's either too hot or too cold. Or her bed's either too soft or too lumpy. Nothing is ever just right. What a fish. Positively festooned. Bethany would swoon. What was that? Nodded off, I suppose. Hit the floor hard enough.
You didn't try the cheese, did you? Are you joking? It tastes of despair. I'm not That's a madman. You dropped the pie. I'm sorry, monsieur. It's really not that bad. Just put it back on the plate and cover it up with some gravy. Careful. I must be hearing things. Is someone there? I think I can do that. Oh, my head. What was that about? What was that? it off, I suppose. Hit the floor. My head. What was that about? What was that? That should do it. It's never as easy as it seems, is it? I swear I didn't know. There must be some sort of switch.
something wrong? I don't know. Yes. Don't fret, my dear. Yes, this qualifies as wrong. It's not over yet. But it is over. I knew who you were the moment you arrived. Assassin. Assassin? I thought we were here to steal a jewel. <laughs> then she didn't tell you. The elf is a Junari. Your Kunari? It's complicated. I assume Talis has her reasons. My, she chose you well, didn't she? Look. I came to stop the heart from doing something we will all regret. He didn't. Leave him out of this. And waste all the effort I spent luring you here before the heart's arrival? Don't be foolish. Asse hasatra mas. Mas avas trasu kolon. Take them away. The elf was Kunari. And the dwarf has no beard. I know it made no sense to me either. Maybe they cut her horns off. The Kunari are not a race. They are a religion. What I don't understand is why a Kunari agent would try to kill one of her own people. And why involve the champion? Excellent questions. I expect answers to match. I live to please. I have a question. When the Duke told you what I was, you said you didn't care. Was that true? You could have told me the truth. I might have listened. And what if you didn't? I suppose we'll never know. I am sorry. This didn't work out like I planned. Obviously. What was your plan, exactly? The one I expected to find is named Samit, a member of the Ben Hasra, the Heart of the Many. I was told he's here to sell secrets to the Orlesians, and I came to stop him. I... Suppose I was misinformed. So you came here to stop this Salit from betraying your people? You probably won't believe me, but this isn't a political mission. It's... personal. What do you mean? Salit was my best Rathari, the one who recruited me into the Ben Hasrith. My tutor. He's the one who saw my potential, convinced me that I could make a difference. It doesn't matter now. But you said he was selling secrets. He is. Or at least he intends to. One last act of defiance. I can't let him do that. Not when he'll hurt so many others in the process. You mean he'll hurt other Kunari? Not every Kunari is a soldier, you know. There are tens of thousands of farmers, artisans, craftsmen. People who have never hurt anyone. People whose only crime is living. They don't deserve what he's going to do to them. But it's more than my duty to stop Salit. It is my moral obligation. You mentioned the heart of the many before, but you said it was the name of the jewel. It's also what Ben Hasrith means. Some people say we're enforcers that keep the Kunari in line, but that's not it. It's hard to explain. Try. We're the soul of the Kune. We keep its spirit alive and protect it from both outside and from within. Not every Kinari agrees, nor do they always do what is best for all. The Ben Hasrath remind us of our common goal. You make them seem almost peaceful. 
It's not always meant to end in violence. There are other paths. They do not all need to lead to the same destination. I probably don't sound very convincing. The way you're talking, it sounds like you're one of these, Ben Hasrath. I am, or I was. Whether I ever am again, I guess that remains to be seen. Is that why you're here? To redeem yourself? Not to them. Doubt is the path one walks to reach faith. To leave the path is to embrace blindness and abandon hope. Another Kunari proverb? She who swallows wisdom in tiny chunks avoids choking. So, did you really involve me just because I had an invitation? You were the only one on the invitation list who wasn't a personal friend of the Montfort family. And you're also Ferelden, with no reason to love or lay. And incredibly competent, so I hear. And what was going to happen when all this was over? I thank you, we go our separate ways. Really? I wouldn't notice a thing? Truth? You're... Not exactly what I was expecting. Perhaps if I'd done my homework, I would have known more about you. Given you the respect you deserve. Nothing I could do about it now. So, everything you told me was a lie? Not everything. So I simply missed the part where you're Kunari. You don't need horns to embrace the Kune. What you need is a purpose. A belief in unity, in improving the lot, not only for your own people, but for everyone. You sound like you actually believe that. I do. Nobody is controlling my mind. I'm not insane. Being Kunari doesn't automatically mean you're a zealot. Most Kunari don't even understand humans, why you act like you do. But I grew up among you. I understand perfectly well. Wait. Aren't you here to kill someone for the Kunari? I never said I was killing him for the Kunari. So you're improving his lot, perhaps repeatedly? <sighs> I know it's hard to understand. Our way of thinking must seem so alien. But just tell me, can you honestly say there's nothing to improve, nothing to strive for? We believe in striving together. We may stumble, but that doesn't mean we shouldn't try. I don't disagree. It's who I am. I joined the Ben Hasras because I felt it meant something. M means something. You sound like you're trying to convince yourself. It's been a long time since I talked to anyone about it. I suppose it's not really a prison cell conversation. I assume you have some sort of plan. I always have a plan. A good one? Oh, ye of little faith. <sighs> the first order of business is getting out of here before His Grace decides we would taste good in the soup. Or whatever he has planned. Any ideas? We didn't come here alone, remember? Aren't dwarves supposed to have some sort of stone sense? Now what good is that? Most of the chateau is stone. Knowing where the floor's at isn't going to help us. Can't you, I don't know, always find your way around in caves or something? Sunshine, all the caves we go to look exactly the same to me. <sighs> That's it. I'm officially tired of waiting to be rescued. Why didn't you just do that before? You said your friends were coming. There you are. What happened? Let's get out of here. So, back through the castle, then? There's a better way than fighting through the Duke's entire army. I'll show you. Here's your equipment talk. Laying around in a locked chest. Then we should head for the caves. That's the way out I planned to take us through, originally. Unless you want to carve your way out through the Duke's army. We'll see. It's up to you which way you want to go, Hawk. 
I'll help you either way. We're good to go. My Easy eternal fire. thanks. I lost a blessing. Through with this hack, he'll wish he'd never picked up a pen. There's something written on the back of this page. Look, I think they're directions. Want to check it out? And this array of sculptures is known as scurvy bastards reflecting on modern life. After much reflection, they appear to have come to the conclusion. Well, I think that's enough. You know, when we get home, we should get our portraits painted. I bet Mother would love that. Oh, but I didn't see this before. There are... Done with my hospitality already, are we? Such a shame. All we want is to get out of here, Duke Prosper. Let us through. Is that all you want? I don't think it's all sheep, boss. You've made your point. Don't make this worse than it needs to be. Odd. I was about to say the same thing to you. Just let him go, Prosper. It's me you want. What I want is to ensure you cannot further hinder my plans. Do your job and kill them, Chasin. Is that not why I keep you around? That is it! Hold them! I'm releasing the pets! You're not getting away with You know, when we get home, we should get our portraits painted. I bet Mother would love that. Oh, but I didn't see... There are directions on the... Got everything from the chateau? The way those rocks look, I don't want to test this path more than once.
now we know where the ghasts came from. We'll have to fight through them. At least we'll slow down the Duke's men as well. This has to be the place the directions were leaked. Surprised it's not full of dark men. <laughs> We're not out of danger. a lake in the middle of the mountain the retreat needed to house hundreds of people during the blight if not thousands can't do that without fresh water but, but it's an entire lake oh that i have no that's odd i could swear there was trust me talis the Circle are not the only ones who know how to break a mage. The Duke is a fool. His enemies are posturing guileless lot. But you are worth testing. Prosper can fight his own battles, and I shall choose mine. Watch out! Did you? you'd left nonsense i found a way around i said i'd get you out of here and i meant it i could have done that blind let's keep going Uncle Gamet, the exit can't be much further into my room he thinks i don't notice but he's not exactly a master criminal has he been in a appropriate he was born that way but no nothing bad as far as I can tell, he's been going through my... Well, well, what have we got here? Ah!
And there's the way out. See? I told you I had a plan. It was a good plan. The kind that had an escape and everything. I think you're right, Talis. So, you could go. There are, however, other options. Coming on a bit strong there, Talis. We've only just met. But we've been through so much together. Wyvern hunts, betrayals, daring escapes from prison. You're right. I'm feeling so close to you right now. <laughs> so, it's true what they say about you. You've been so reasonable since we were captured. I'm hoping that hasn't changed. What Salit is going to do will harm so many innocents. My people, as well as yours. It's my duty to stop him. Even so, I can't do it alone. Not anymore. Explain what's so terrible about Salit's plan. I can't. Not completely. And yes, I know. That's a hard sell. The information Salit plans to turn over to Orle won't just hurt Kinari, however. It will harm anyone living in Kinari lands. Even those who fled the Kinari of any race will be condemned to persecution forever. So this isn't just some political scheme? If only it was. I'm not here on some directive from the Kune. I came... Salit was declared Talvashoth. But they didn't deem intervention worthwhile. I... couldn't agree. I had to try. Doesn't that make you Talvashov as well? No. The Ben Hasrath didn't order me not to do this, but here I am anyway. <laughs> I was trying to earn my way back into their good graces. This probably won't help. Why? What did you do? It's not easy, being an elf in the Kune. You're not born to it like they are. I've struggled to find that peace, that certainty. I know it's there, I just... keep falling short. What about you? Have you ever been a part of something bigger than just yourself? I have friends and family. I'm responsible for all of them. It's not the same thing. The Kunari have a vision of what life should be like. Free from pain and fear and doubt. You see tyranny, and I see caring and interest in the welfare of all. Yes, it could be better, but so could human indifference and cruelty. Or do you disagree? No, you have a point. Then help me stop this before it goes too far. What did you have in mind, exactly? Well, we could go back, maybe have some tea with the Duke, get to know one another. Then, just as he starts to trust us, you slip a bag over his head, and we drag him to Antiva. I hope you're not serious. Or, we could find out when Salit is arriving, and stop him before it's too late. You don't actually think you can finish your mission? Alone? Probably not. But that doesn't mean I shouldn't try. Some things are worth dying for. After everything you've already done, why would I help you again? Because... I've got your nose. The Cune taught you that. If I were following the Cune, I would actually have your nose. I suppose that doesn't help. If I had my way, you would never have been this involved in the first place. see your side. What now? That's up to you. I couldn't force you to help, even if I wanted to. I get the feeling you're an exceptional person, Hawk. Here's your chance to prove it.
Thank you, Hawk. I... Thank you. The old entrance should get us 